Mason Inc. TV, Black Jesus, the ambassador to the streets, back to drop more jewels about the music business. RBI, man, real business information, music biz one-on-one. -on -one. This particular video right here is how to approach people that you don't know to sell your merchandise and to gain them as a fan and pushing your music. Now, let's dig into it. Now, in order to pull this off right here, you got to have everything on your back end together. Like, you have to have a plan. Um, or what your whole thing, what your brand is and what your brand is supposed to be. How you want that brand to be put out there. Also, next, you want to make sure that the product that you're pushing, the brand that you're pushing, whether it's your CD, whether it's your socks, whether it's your t-shirts, whether it's your headband, whether it's jump drives, whatever it is, make sure it's quality. You want to have a dope artwork. Matter of fact, it's part of the elements of hip-hop, which is graffiti. So having your presentation a1 your t-shirts dope your your cd cover dope it ain't all bootleg looking nothing wrote on with a sharpie you know everything has been invested um in the proper places so the professional people that do what they do get you right not just letting your homeboy do your cover to your cd and now you're trying to sell it that ain't gonna work so you gotta put the investment in first before you can even hit the block or after the show or before the show or wherever you are to sell your merchandise you got to put that, that work in first you got to invest in yourself but once you get that quality look and it's ready to go now we gonna dig into the subject see this music ain't never been for ordinary people it's always been for the ones that vibrate higher you know, that's what MCs are. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're not like anybody else. So, with that being said, even when you're approaching the uh, people to sell your product, you want to be clean. Everywhere you go, you a brand. You want to look good. You want to have an appearance about yourself. And when you get out, somebody trying to figure out who you are. That's the key to it. You know what I'm saying? Like, the chicks, they got to all want to just give it to you and the dudes gotta wanna be like you that's the secret but you it all got to be within you it gotta be organic you can't do what nobody else do you can't steal nobody else flavor you can't grind like the next man grind that's why I say you gotta have a plan going into it now once you approach this person man you clean you got your look together the product looking good you step up to him now it's just all about the talk game and you selling yourself you selling your brand be professional you know um greet them you know you know how you doing you know what i'm saying um you know how you day um independent artist uh you know out here working get my grind on i have a um cd that i'm working or i have merchandise that i'm trying to sell and my whole brand is just to make sure that I uh, do what you do and go into your spiel and you captivate that person. You explain to them what makes you different. Why should I buy this t-shirt? Why should I buy this sock? Why should I buy this that CD? So when you got the look to it and you got the feel to it, then when you're talking to them, man, you're just chopping it up. But see, this is what separates the true MCs from, I guess, the rappers, you can say. Because the true MCs are the businessmen. And you get out here and they understand that you're selling yourself. So now it's time to do the work. It's, it, now it's time to grind. It's time to get in business mode. But at the same time, you still want that coolness about you. You still want that edge about you. You know, you still want to have that street knowledge to go along with that 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 business that you're doing along with the incredible music and the professional look to that product and it's undeniable sometimes you'll run up on people that don't have it sometimes you know make deals with them some you might throw them a t-shirt depending on who they are you might throw them a cd a pair of socks depending on that person but you always want it to look good because they might not pop your cd in at that particular moment they might not rock their shirt at that particular time. But as time go by, they're going to look at it 
and when that presentation right is gonna remind them of everything and that's what that's what's gonna give you that look that's what's gonna give you that play that fan because now they got a piece of you so make sure when you out here grind the MCs, artists film c's r b whatever that you went to when you're doing this independent thing and you're doing it on your own you have to wear plenty of hats Unfortunately, in the streets is, is, is definitely one of them. We're going to take it back to the old school when we kissing babies, shaking hands, putting up posters, really out here grinding. But you have to make sure that you're approachable. You have to make sure that everything is in place so it'll be an easy sell. You know, it'll sell itself. You know, you won't have to over talk, you know, your product because, you know, you got a Sharpie written on with your CD trying to sell it with no cover just in the sleeve. Or your shirt, you know, it's... Um, your T-shirt that you're selling is 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 not good quality, you know, and uh, you know, you're trying to put your whole brand on it, and we just not buying it. So approach is everything. Approach, approach to the game, approach to how you do everything. You know, it's always a way to get it. So y'all keep grinding, keep doing it right. Stay with the promos. Stay with that merchandise, cause that's the bloodline of your company. That's what's going to get you right. And make sure while you out here selling that product after your shows and when you get off your set, always keep something with you. You know, book bag or something, you know, send old swag bag with you. You know, I know a lot of y'all guys in the purses these days, man, purses and fanny pack strap, cross the chest and all that. Have your promo stuff in there and all that so when you roll, you're ready to go. You know what I'm saying? So you can um practice and uh get real familiar and and uh well and conscious about how you interact with people because at the end of the day that's what's gonna get you far in this game is how the how your fans feel about you do you have their heart once you got their heart it's a done deal so y'all keep grinding right man had to put this video out here man like this video share this video uh if you watch it on youtube hit that su subscribe button y'all tell a friend get in these comments let's chop it up man dropping jewels y'all rallo jesus go april 20th 2019 the artist network conference calls rallo jesus brings you artist network radio an all independent artist music network artists email your songs for rotation to artnet radio gmail.com that's artnet radio at gmail.com independent artists it's time for the world to hear you artist network radio radio mga 